Hello guys and thank you for clicking onto this video. Now you obviously clicked onto this video to find out how to make an amazing thumbnail and here's how. First things first, you want to open your web browser, mine being Google Chrome. You then want to type in Pixlr in the top. The link will be in the description. Then when you come onto the site, you want to scroll down until you get to this bit where it says Pixlr Editor. You then launch the web app, create a new image, Change the width to 1280 and the height to 720 and then click the transparent box. When you get on, what you want to do is you want to get the picture you want to use. Now let's say I'm recording an escapist video and I need to get a new thumbnail while I'm uploading. What I want to do is I want to type in the escapists 1280 times 720. And then you click images and you look for the image you would like to use. Now I already have an image saved onto my computer so I'm not going to download another image. I'll use this one which I normally used. Ah, ah, ah. And then what you want to do is while it's on you want to type in control A, control C, click this, control V. So there you see it's on. Now you don't want it just to be this because you could have just saved that and then used that as thumbnail. But no you don't want to do that. You want to click this uh, text thing. You want to click the image and then you want to type in what's let, let's say it's episode 1 so I'd put hashtag 1. I'd change the size all the way up and I'd make it white because that is very very nice and then you want to change this to bold or or you you know you can do whatever size or whatever any of this you want you can, there's many options I can like I've uh, downloaded a few fonts uh, I can make a tutorial on that if you guys would like to see that so when you've chosen the font what you want to use you want to click on this so when you click on that you want to click that layer styles click the out of glow click that bit and then change you want like I want my bit to be black so it sort of matches the escapist logo and then what you want to do is you want to put the hardness all the way up or just choose the options you want like you can have the size all the way up like that but no that I don't think that looks very nice to me and then look you see it is very nice very cool very handsome I like it and then let's say that you don't really you, you sort of want it so people can click on it you just you don't just want a hashtag one on it so you want to change the faces on some of them so what you want to do is type in memes transparent or transparent memes or whatever uh, make sure it's a png i mean i don't know if it really matters but look you see, you'll, you'll find some which are transparent like this is transparent however i already have some saved into my computer because i'm just prepared for this you want to find the one you want to use so let's say i want this dirt face you want to control a control c click on the image control v now what you want to do is you want to click this bit and move the head on there now it doesn't fit perfectly so you want to press edit free transform and then you can change the shape shape <laughs> shape you want to change the shape of the head so you click this and you see look that looks that looks almost perfect let me make it better there you see how cool does that look and obviously you can create more of them you can open image you can find some better ones so let's get this one remember control oh <laughs> Control S is to save it if you'd like to save it, but Control A, Control C, and then Control V. And then you'll drag it to the face you want it to go on and free transform it as much as you wish. And this is how to create an awesome thumbnail. However, obviously you need to save after, so you'll press File, Save, and then obviously you want the quality all the way up. You'll choose the name to, like, that name doesn't really matter. You just press OK. You'll save it to your computer as thumbnail or something like that. And you see the thumbnail is on and then what you want to do is you want to go on YouTube and you want to change the thumbnail of your videos and just make it all good like that. And obviously since you've saved it, it doesn't matter about keeping this, you can just leave this page and then you can change the thumbnail on YouTube. So yeah, that is how you do it. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe if you're new. I uh, hope this video helped you. Have an amazing day and remember to smile more. Goodbye my friends.